Did you know my mom was getting free time? Here, one another one. Get you some more. Where you put it? Are you collecting them? Mommy, you want another one? Look at it, y'all. She's just gonna collect them. So she's free playing for a minute. Let me check on all these babies in here. All our babies are looking good. We went ahead and gave Morticia a piece of banana to kind of calm her down. As y'all seen in the last video, she's been kind of bitey with me, but I think I've calmed her down pretty good. After these babies are raised, we're gonna attempt to take her out and let her roam around and see how she acts. All my other rats are doing pretty good at this moment. Morticia's, Morticia is the only sketchy one that I have here that will bite every once in a while. All my other rats, man, I mean, they come to the doors whenever they're called. And yeah, we only have two in here right now because mama's over here just chilling. She's gonna eat her snacks. She's hopping them right now. Give them back to her. She's gonna go hide them. That's what rats do, fellas. But they are very tame and very docile rats. Um, let me see where she at. Y'all both look alike. That's Mama Peanut right there. See, she's trying to, she smells the food. We're gonna give her a treat. That's Mama Peanut. But this is Mama No Name right here. This one was bought full grown with Morticia. And just look at the calmness of this rat here. She started letting me pick her up. Very docile. This is Peanut. We raised her since she was a little cute baby. Ain't that right, Peanut? So we'll go ahead and give them some treats too. While Mama over here just tours around here. Come on, y'all. Get some more treats. Y'all like them, huh? All right, love. You want some? Get you some too. Down here, we got all our babies. Here in a few days, we're gonna make us a little cage for this cute sucker here. This one would not be fed off. All the other ones on the other hand, I mean, sucks to say, but snakes gotta eat. But while they are in my presence, they will have the best life possible. Cause they are still cute. That's Cloud. Cloud has always been sketchy, man. But she has been raised up since she was a baby here at Drago's Python. So y'all check the other videos. We saved her because of her stomach. Look at that cloud. So beautiful. We need to get some zip ties like I told y'all before. We'll go ahead and do that soon. And we only have two daddies here at Drago's. That's all we need, fellas. If y'all ever interested in breeding. I mean, you only really need one of these guys. I'll show y'all here probably today we'll probably go ahead and put cloud look at that sucker right there hanging on the screen upside down y'all this amazes, amazes me every day what these rats can come up with look at that ain't that something they learn from the best i guess so if y'all interested in raising your own rats i mean it's relatively easy you just have to come in here and show them some attention once a day. I mean, and it doesn't even have to be long, fellas. I'm talking about like three minutes a day. That's all they take. Still got mom over here, Roman. Come on, we'll go put these in your cage. Come on. You wanna come? Come on, let's go. Come on, put them in your mouth. Daddy gonna bring you in the cage, you fat. You pregnant, girl, come on. Hey, come on, you big sucker, you. We'll go put her back in the cage. Here, take your treats. Now you enjoy your day, all right, mama? Everybody on YouTube likes you because you're so sweet. All right, well, there you have it, fellas. That's how we do it here. We let them all get some Roman time. Morticia will get Roman time soon. We believe she's a little older than what I thought she was. Her eyes starting to gray up. This this batch may be her last batch until we retire her. Might go ahead and give her one more, depending on how she responds. She's still having massive 
litters, man, I'm telling you. She's had a litter of 15, a litter of 16, and a litter of 17 here at Drago's just in the past three months. She's doing awesome. But we may go ahead and just retire her, put her in a cage alone. Not alone, but with another rat, and let her live out her life here. All my breeders, none of the breeders will die here. Well, they will die eventually. They only last about two years, maybe three years, depending on how much you breed them and how you treat them. But they all will die, sadly. But none of them will die by the snakes. They will die of natural causes or infections or whatever diseases they may carry. But diseases are very unlikely here because they were all bred since a baby. The only one that possibly could have anything is Morticia because she was probably raised at another farm that was probably not as clean as that we keep it here. But I don't wanna talk down on nobody. You know, people have millions of rats in some places and you can't give them all the best life. I like to keep it small, just enough to breed for the snakes and maybe a little bit extra to keep. All right, fellas, until next time, Drago's Pythons.